So a mysterious object from deep space is racing toward our solar system at 130,000 miles per hour, and Harvard scientists think it might be nuclear-powered. This is in science fiction. The third confirmed visitor from beyond our solar system is showing characteristics that have researchers questioning everything. And that's not even the worst part. This thing appears to be generating its own lights, like coming from itself. And this simply is it not something that happens in nature. It's something that comets just don't naturally do. And it's also perfectly timed to visit multiple planets with odds so impossible, they suggest internal navigation. And what I'm about to tell you is gonna blow your mind. So my name's Tom, I'm with the Daily Beltway. I'm also publisher of the Illinois Review and a White House correspondent for the Next News Network. On July 1st, NASA detected something extraordinary, an object called 3i Atlas hurtling through space from beyond our own solar system. And scientists first thought it was just a comet, and they were wrong. It's producing its own light. Check this out. That we do have is an analysis of the brightness profile of the glow of 3i Atlas. And have a look at this figure, something that's actually a little difficult to interpret. And I have a hard time interpreting it also. But the one thing to keep in mind is how steep the slope is. It is a projected power loss slope of negative three, which implies a three-dimensional emissivity profile with a radial power loss slope of negative four. Now, what all that garbage means is that this object has a much steeper light curve than we have observed in natural comets. So together with a colleague named Eric Quito, Avi Loeb realized that the observed slope of negative four is consistent with an alternative model in which the dust outflow around 3i Atlas is being illuminated by a central source. In other words, this object is creating its own light, not ref That is just insane. So Harvard's, uh, Harvard's Dr. Avi, Avi Loeb, and I know I butchered the name, guys. I am horrible with names. Everybody's like, you can't pronounce his name right. You shouldn't be doing this. Well, I suck at names. So everybody sucks at something, and I suck at names. So uh, Harvard's Dr. Avi Loeb published findings showing 3i Atlas may be generating its own light source. And Hubble images reveal a mysterious forward-facing glow from the object's nucleus, not typical sunlight reflection. And Loeb's calculations show this requires an internal energy source, like a possibly being nuclear powered, I guess. Unlike every comet we've studied, 3i Atlas shows no gas molecules, no ice sublimation, no tail pointing away from the sun. Instead, it leads like literally a leading glow towards the sun, as if something is actively pushing particles ahead of its path. 